With the emergence of various forms of green energy solutions, nano-diamond batteries have proven themselves to be the top contenders in terms of energy. In today's video, we're discussing why these batteries are unmatched. The nano-diamond battery is a diamond-based alpha, beta, and neutron high-powered Voltiac battery that can provide lifelong green energy for numerous applications and overcome the limitations of existing chemical batteries. This battery acts like a tiny nuclear generator because its power source is high with intermediate-level radioisotopes that are shielded for safety by multiple levels of synthetic diamond. Through an inelastic scattering process, the energy is absorbed in the diamond, which is then used to generate electricity. For the full lifetime of any device or machine, with up to 28,000 years of battery life, a self-charging process will provide a charge. Since the battery requires only exposure to natural air because of its self-charging, any excess charge can be stored in secondary cells, capacitors, and supercapacitors to extend battery life for aircraft, cell phones, electric vehicles, rockets, rockets, sensors, and other devices as well as machinery. To facilitate charge collection as a device, the DNV has a combination of metal, semiconductor, and ceramic that has two contact surfaces. Via conductive channels that are fabricated by deposition of nickel on the side of the DNV to create a positive and negative contact of the battery system, several single units are connected together, called DNV stacks. In between these are radioisotopes that will release either an alpha, beta, or neutron radiation upon decay to generate charges that are collected by the charge collectors. This is then inelastically scattered in the single crystalline diamond. The DNV stack consists of a high energy output source in every layer. This kind of arrangement provides a multi-layer safety shield for the product that improves the overall efficiency of the system. It's known that all radioisotopes produce immense amounts of heat due to the presence of a single crystalline diamond in the DNV unit. The strategic placement of the source between the DNV units facilitates inelastic scattering. This design enables rapid conversion to the usable electricity and prevents self-absorption of heat by the radioisotope. With minimal self-absorption, the thin film profile exhibited by nano-diamond batteries allows radiation absorption in the SCD. This technology can take any shape and form in accordance with the application due to its flexible design structure, where the minimum size limit is 40 micrometers. Nano-diamond batteries can be made as big as the application requires. Covering mechanical, thermal, and radiation safety, the key innovations of nano-diamond batteries are sophisticated safety features. Using a diamond encapsulator that contains the radiation within the device, radiation safety is achieved. Along with the source, the DNV stacks are coated with a layer of polycrystalline diamond, which is known for having the ability to contain the radiation within the device and being the most thermally conductive material. Also, making the battery tough and tamper-proof, it's 12 times tougher than stainless steel. In a hole and cap structure that captures radiation from the DNV, the nanolayers are made of lead and chromium, acting as a thermal conduction channel that conducts heat to the outer portion of the encapsulator. It can contain and absorb secondary radiation as well as the primary radiation close to background radiation levels absorbed, while the cap captures the radiation that comes out of the hole built into the diamond encapsulator component of the nano-diamond battery. During operation, the high energy source present in the battery system produces heat leading to thermal conduction in the system. With respect to the outer surface of the diamond to keep the interiors at an optimum level, thermal vents in the system help conduct this process. In addition to alpha and beta, to utilize every aspect of the system, nano-diamond batteries also incorporate the use of neutron radiation with boron-10 doping that helps to convert the extra neutron into alpha rays. Production of feasible isotopes such as plutonium-232 and uranium-232 using a nuclear power source for a battery system brings up the question of nuclear proliferation. Nano-diamond batteries use a lock-in system called an ion implantation mechanism to tackle this issue because this mechanism prevents usage other than power generation, which in turn increases usability by meeting consumer safety requirements. Heavily prompted by various governments, electric vehicles have been one of the fastest growing fields in recent years. Hence, naturally, the battery that propels the vehicle has also been heavily developed as its key component. Nano-diamond batteries power the traditional aspects of the car as well as the motors as the battery solution. In addition, innovations such as augmented reality, heads-up displays, self-driving, and onboard AI could also be supported using the nano-diamond battery, which is perhaps the most interesting aspect. Any excess could be sold to the grid, where the nano-diamond battery-powered EV could be plugged into a house where the generated charge could then power the house. Moreover, it could be used during the day to power the car and at night when the car is parked. This effectively means that alleviating the increased electricity demand that comes with the increased adoption rate of EVs can be done by using the national grid as crowdsourcing electricity. Many of the technological advancements come from the digital revolution and the aviation market is vast, including powering the black box to aid in the salvage of missing aircraft as well 
well as securing essential power to areas such as the cockpit to improve airline safety are examples of its uses. The availability of the signal is based on the battery that powers the black box. It sends out a signal periodically to broadcast its location. Currently, since the location signal will become unavailable once the battery charge runs out, is a limitation in the battery charge of the black box because it restricts the search time. Allowing a search party a greater chance of salvage, it will be able to increase the battery life of the black box. These little yet powerful batteries could power the International Space Station in astronaut spacesuits. Hindered by concerns regarding longevity of safety, the rise of electric aircraft and recent advances in space technology have led to increasing demand for their battery systems. Currently, space vehicles and satellites are heavily reliant on solar power, which harsh space environments can disrupt. While allowing for longer activity, nanodiamond batteries can be utilized to power space rovers, drones, satellites, electric aircraft, spacesuits, and stations. Implantables such as hearing aids and pacemakers and in-situ medical devices with the added benefit of safety can benefit from long battery life in a similar package. Due to its long half-life, patients no longer have to worry about recharging a pacemaker. Also, it prevents radiation leaks from implantable devices since a nanodiamond battery has a layer of native radiation absorber integrated into its structure, providing power to those that are difficult to implement and to many routine applications. Its power output, safety, and universality. The applications of a nanodiamond battery make it an outstanding promise for futuristic applications and productivity, as well as remote locations, data centers, and hostile environments. In the physical devices themselves is one shortfall of the Internet of Things. They inevitably will need electricity, since each function, such as lighting, will need Wi-Fi connectivity receivers and sensors. In either case, there are limitations even though traditionally this has been satisfied by the use of batteries and direct electrical wiring. However, wires require an electrician to set up, which could be inconvenient, and batteries will run flat. The Internet of Things devices could be placed anywhere without the need to worry about the battery depleting, because they would be fully wireless if a nanodiamond battery was used. Being inert to the environment and not requiring cobalt mining means nanodiamond batteries are green as they have no emission. A nanodiamond battery is a more weather-independent, longer-lasting, and an energy-dense alternative to traditional energy sources. The added values are recycling of nuclear waste and lack of harmful byproducts. Reducing toxic metal waste products and their negative environmental impacts caused by an emission, the technology has the potential to replace other energy sources such as lithium-ion batteries and gasoline. A crucial component of lithium-ion batteries, cobalt, is in a bout of shortage. The nanodiamond battery is a solution that is not affected by the supply shortage of its raw material, since it does not contain cobalt. Finally, a market that is a natural fit for nanodiamond batteries and one of the most important recent trends is the sudden increase in demand for electric vehicles. We have seen governments around the world working towards shifting fossil fuel-powered vehicles to electric vehicles. Let us know in the comments if you think nanodiamond batteries are going to begin replacing a vast majority of energy solutions in upcoming years.